Facing Bryce Greenlee, the designated hitter. Today's first pitch. Ball one. Injury. Swing and a miss. Strike three. And the first batter that Grayson Sonia sees, he's all game. Strike three, call. Back to back case for the freshman. One, two. Popped him up. Harris behind home plate. Has a good read on it. And out number three. First inning of Grayson Sonia's career, three up, three down. Transfer. He was number 11 on their list of 50. And he takes a four pitch walk. They can command all four pitches. Two walks this inning now for Nate Rolka. Joey Silent, who was a starting pitcher, moved to a relief pitcher. This one's hit deep to left field at the warning track. Kane loses it in the sun. On his way to third. Heading home is Groff. Play at the plate's not in time. His old Miss debut. Bad pitch here. Alderman to third. Not in time. With, with the transfer that they added, and Leje skies one to the gap. Left center. Dunyan squeezes to make the play. Here comes Alderman from third base. Old Miss up 2 nothing in the bottom of the first. Two for four yesterday. It's this one left side. Beat the shift. Around third, Calvin Harris. 3-0 Ole Miss in the bottom of the first. Calarco off to a hot start in his Ole Miss career. I have to worry about with this Ole Miss Rebel team. They're going to play the game the right way and play it hard. Third walk this inning for Nate. Elected into the College Baseball Hall of Fame. Furness hits this one deep into right center field, but not enough as Dunyan makes the catch. Ole Miss puts up three to go up early on Delaware in the bottom half of the first. World Series have been from the SEC. Eight of the last ten years, they've had the most teams in College World yeah. Series. Yeah, think about it. Back top side for Ole Miss as Groff pops this one up in the infield. Battling the sun. Oh, it drops! Chatnier's thrown out, though. That's the second time today the sun has been a factor for Delaware's defense. Runner breaks for second base. It's called the strike. And Groff's in at second base with the stolen, with the stolen bag. Rolka's ready. Gonzalez punches it the other way. Groff hits third. He scores without a throw. And Jacob Gonzalez beats the shift. Ole Miss leads 4 0. Great piece of hitting by Jacob Gonzalez. Two strike swing. Just you don't have to swing so hard. You screw yourself into the dirt at home plate. Just pokes that ball. Gets a nice pitch for him to go the other way to get the RBI. But another Ole Miss Rebel beating the shift. Ball four. Really been known to have good approaches at the plate. Leger pops up, third base side. And Loind makes the catch. It's a hard pitch to dodge, too, that's, that's for sure. As McCants reaches on the walk, the Furnace's father, Eddie, was inducted into the Hall of Fame on your screen a moment ago. Double play ball, and Delaware turns it. Down the line, fair ball for J.J. Freeman and into the corner. Freeman jets to second base with a standing double to lead off the top half of the sixth. Outside edge, no, he just missed it. Two on, nobody down for Delaware here in the sixth. Elevated. Strike three, call. Sits him down for out number two this year than it was last year. And Kimbrell walks Diaz, and with two outs, the bases are loaded. And make it three more. Swing and a miss, Doherty gets out of the jam. Chatnier lines this one to left, and it gets down for a two-out single. 
A multi-hit game for Peyton Chatnier. He's two for two. Ethan Groff at the plate. Here's this one, shallow left center field. Dunyan can't get there, Chatnier around third. He's gonna score. He avoided disaster on the base paths. Avoided a tag and now it's a run. Yes, indeed. And Ethan Groff is appreciative of that swim slide that Chatnier made at second base because this is an RBI single for Ethan Groff. Continue to second base. Swing and a miss from Gonzalez. That's out number three. Full count delivery. Swing and a miss. First two batters that Doherty has seen today. He struck them out. 2-2 offering. Got another one. Fly ball to center field. Groff gets a read on it. Three up, three down for Delaware in the seventh. Stretch time, it's Swayze. He was injured. Ole Miss kind of took a step backwards and hit a rut when he came back. Harris gets under this one. Routine fly ball, right center. And Lesher pops out of his mid. Alderman to second base. Lift off, deep left field. It's got a chance, more than a chance. Goodbye. He's the second freshman this weekend to Homer in his first at bat as an Ole Miss Rebel. I think Greg Mamula wants this one reviewed. Well, this ball is absolutely demolished. I mean, it went so far that you almost lose it. We're talking Kemp Alderman area back there. It cleared the first, I don't know, dozen rows out there went over. One down in the inning. Line drive to left center. Find space. McCants wants a double. The throw in. Now the bats starting to come together for Ole Miss here in the seventh. Foaming apple juice. Yes. Chatnier draws the walk. Shoots this one the other way to right. Lesher makes the catch, and that's the end of the seventh inning in Oxford. DC. True, fair, yep. Fourth strikeout of the day for Jack Doherty. Swing and a miss. Five strikeouts for Doherty. Series finale between these two teams. Kane gets into one, deep right field. McCants on the run, makes the catch. Long third out in the top half of the eighth. A lot of tools, good range, great arm, and it's the bat as well. Sit. Sorry about that. No, the ability for him to hit the other way is right on cue as we were complimenting his skill set. Nice piece of hitting. Kramer lofts this one over the head of Cavino. Sime stops at second base. Back-to-back -back singles for Ole Miss. Basketballs. <laughs> Oh, and it hits him. Base is loaded. On the ground, right side, and through the glove of Petrich in the right. One run scores around third. Here comes Kramer. He slides in head first, safe. Ball game in Oxford. 10 0. Ole Miss takes down Delaware. Garrett Wood, I guess you could say, walking it off <laughs> in a way here in Oxford. That's the salty vet for you, going up there, take two strikes, getting an 0-2 count, hit a foul ball, and get you a game winner to get the run rule in effect. Ole Miss Rebels with the second victory of the year. Great job.